Hey, it's Joe Tamargo from WetHeadPumpRepair.com. All right, the first thing you want to do is hit the subscribe button below. That way you'll get the latest and greatest videos delivered right to your inbox. All right, welcome back. This video is sponsored by PoolAndSpa.com. All right, so if you need a brand new filter or a brand new pump, head on over to PoolAndSpa.com. They also sell parts for these filters, for the Hayward EC40 filters. All right, so here we go. We're back with the Hayward EC40 uh, pump and filter rebuild series, okay? So we're going to be talking about in this video is what are the fingers inside of your um, filter? A lot of people always say like, hey, you know, um, I heard one kind of filter has fingers, some other filters have grids. What's the difference? Well, obviously a grid is a grid. A grid is a square. And when we get to those other videos, when we'll be showing you those, uh, we'll show you what a grid filter is. Or just search the channel and we can show you what a grid filter is. Okay? Now, in this in this video, we're, we're talking about the Hayward Perflex. So basically, this is what they call a finger filter. Okay? See these little things here? They're called fingers. Okay? And what happens is they're coated with a nylon coating. And inside the, that nylon coating are these pieces of plastic. Now, what happens is as your pool water comes into the filter, filter, the pool water goes through here, right? And then it gets, you know, the fingers catch all the dirt and everything, which the diatomaceous earth powder sticks to. So basically, when you add, you know, you run your pool filter, right? And as you run your pool filter, the water goes through just like that. Then you add your diatomaceous earth into it with it, but the diatomaceous earth, which is that powder, gets stuck to the fingers, okay? And But it's, it's thick enough where it doesn't go through the filters, but thin enough where it's still going to allow water to pass through it. Then what happens after that, right? All the dirt and everything gets stuck to the diatomaceous earth, okay? And then after a while, it gets full like a vacuum cleaner bag. And that's when you backwash, you bump this handle up and down like this, and that shakes off all the diatomaceous earth, okay? And then once you shake off all the diatomaceous earth, you would open up your backwash valve, which would be on the filter tank, and then you wash out all the diatomaceous earth. These fingers become totally clean again. And then basically you're back to square one and you, you know, start to pool filter, you add more diatomaceous earth, and then, you know, your filter runs until it builds up pressure. And then once it builds up pressure, then, you know, you'll have to backwash it, which will clean off the earth once again. And that's the whole complete backwashing cycle. So we're going to continue rebuilding this filter. Um, like I said, remember, this video is sponsored by PoolAndSpa.com, great company in business over 20 years. Uh, they have fi these filters in stock. They have the uh, fingers in stock. They have the tube sheets, which we're going to be showing you how to work on in a second. But we just wanted to talk about how the filter works, you know, what the filter grids, uh, filter fingers did, and how the diatomaceous earth sticks to it and everything, all right? So when we come back, we're going to be talking about how to take off a couple more parts, and then we're going to show you how to access the tube sheets, and we're going to show you how to take apart the tube sheets and replace the tube sheets, all right? So this is Joe Tamargo. This video is sponsored by PoolAndSpa.com. Thanks for watching. All right, so this was basically a video to teach you, once again, how it works. Water comes into your filter, runs through here. You put diatomaceous earth. That sticks to your filter grids, right? Then the, the, the dirt and everything fix, sticks to that. And then once everything builds up, you'll have to backwash it. But we want to let you know that these are fingers. This is not a grid filter. This is a finger filter. And we're going to show you in a second how to take these out. All right, thanks for watching. Visit PoolAndSpa.com. Visit WetheadPumpRepair.com. See you later. Peace.